Welcome back, guys, and I have an update for you. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, video quality is going to be a lot better, but I just got done with my rod holder, or my fishing pole holder, before the season starts. So that way I can just, it, it can hold more than four rods. Um, you just have to cut another notch in it right about in here, and then another one in here somewhere. But four is plenty. For me right now uh, I have others but these are going to be the main rods that I'm going to be using so let's go in order from oldest to newest coincidentally I have it like that so this rod right here um, was actually my dad's and he gave it to me so uh, this one's mine I got this one when I was like 10 or 11 then I got this one two years ago and I loved it. It's an agility. And it's got, I think, 15 pound, 15 to 17 pound floral on it. Uh, this one's brand new. Uh, this is a um, Berkeley, I forget what this one is. Oh, this is the Berkeley Cherry one. I've got it partnered with a Shakespeare bait casting reel. I got it on sale for at Walmart for five bucks. They're usually about forty, so I'm happy. I paid seventy for the agility, so that uh, that was the second, no, third bait caster I ever owned. Uh, reel that is. First one was the Shakespeare that I have on the cherry wood. And the second one was an outdoor angler off brand Walmart reel. So um I got an update for you on the kayak and that is coming along. Uh I got hard baits right there. Um hooks, terminal tackle. Uh this is a jig and other miscellaneous weights box. Um Soft plastics are in the black storage part. Um, I still gotta. I do have to get the um, one of these knobs right there, that silver thing or the shiny that right there. I gotta get one for this Shima, or the Shakespeare one because it doesn't have it. It's basically a spool tensioner, so you gotta have one of them or else it'll backlash every cast. Um. Ice fishing, uh, I caught two northerns last weekend, so they weren't bad. Um, kayak, I'm going to be launching it probably somewhere in mid-April. There's still ice on the lake, and today is March 8th, no, 10th. Today is March 10th, 2019, so I will be fishing pre-spawn bass. So they will be up in the shallows looking for places to bed. So I will be fishing uh, the channel of a lake. Uh, I will be throwing jigs. Um, I will be throwing some jerk baits, some rattle traps, a small square bill. Uh, maybe a couple soft plastics if I need to. Might get some live shiners if I need to. But as soon as the ice has gone off of the main place I like to fish, there's ledges over there. And this, that's what this rod is for, is for crappie. But I've caught nice bass on it. The cherry wood's new. I got it yesterday night, so that's, that's always good. Um, ice fishing season's pretty much over for me. So it's time to get into regular fishing again. So I have all steel leaders on this year. I, well, these ones. I switched a lot of them over. I'm, s I don't know. Trout are gonna stay the same. Uh, nothing new on this. So, I mean, it is what it is. Um. Yeah. So it's basically coming down to the wire here to get stuff done and get it ready. Uh, I got all my soft plastics in the kayak, or most of them. So, just an update for you guys, and I will see you in the next video.